Okay, we're gonna be working on cactus collage background. Step one is going to be putting our name on our paper. Please use the crown that matches your table. Supply manager will pass that out to you. The folder holder, you're gonna get your folder, give everybody a white piece of paper. Please make sure you return the folder to my box because these will be wet. Get your paper vertical, top to bottom. Everybody's going to write their name and teacher's code. Please check with Miss Lawson if you don't remember it. Please make sure everybody gets their crown back in your um, basket before we move to the next step. You're going to flip your paper over. We are gonna be creating a colorful background to glue our cactus onto. The paints we're using are a little bit different. They're like a watercolor paint, but they're not. Um, the disc stays in here, we can't take them out. And I'm gonna show you how to get the paint off it because if you notice, if when it's dry, no paint will come off like a watercolor and it's not sticky. So when the supply manager brings the tray to the table, make sure you take the little paint tray off, put it to the side. Then the captain will give everybody a paintbrush. And what you have to do to get it wet is you have to add water on top. So you get your water and then you make a circle, kind of get a little more water on top of that. Now you still need to wash off your brush every time you switch colors because it will mess up the paint on the, um, the actual disc of paints. So what you're doing is we're just adding all different colors to our background, kind of like a um, sunset, but we're, oops, I did not wash my paintbrush off good enough, but we are gonna use warm and cool colors. It does not have to be in a specific order. The only color you're not going to use is green. Green is the only color that you will not see in the sky. So make sure that you use all the other colors except for green. Decide. Make sure that you get your paintbrush here on top in the house. Supply manager, please make sure that you carefully pick up your paints, put them on top of your water before you head back to the drying rack. Everybody else, make sure you listen for texture, texture, texture. 